You're watching ESC News. Thank you for joining us. Angkor's Archaeological Park is commemorating its 30th anniversary of its inclusion on the UNESCO World Heritage List on the 14th of December 2022. Angkor Archaeological Park was added to the UNESCO World Heritage List on the 14th of December 1992. ESC News reporter Anthony Ellis has the details. According to Prime Minister Hun Sen Facebook page, this is a reminder to all Cambodian children to love and participate in preserving the heritage, especially to express deep gratitude to the Cambodian ancestors who sacrificed for the glorious cause of the Cambodian civilization in the past, as well as the continuous struggle of country's leaders to overcome all obstacles to protect the prestige heritage of the nation and the world. The Royal Government of Cambodia is firmly committed to preserving the magnificent heritage. Angkor Archaeological Park is a major tourist destination attraction means of international and local tourists to explore and learn about Cambodia's culture heritage. Following the inclusion of the Angkor Archaeological Park in the World Heritage List, the International Conference was held in Tokyo from October 12 to 13, 1993, under the intensive of the Government of Japan, also with the support from France and UNESCO, to develop strategies and action plans for the protection, conservation and development of Angkor Archaeological Park site. The International Coordinating Committee, ICC Angkor, was formed in December 1993 to achieve this purpose. Angkor Archaeological Park referred only to Angkor Wat, but the entire Angkor area, including archaeological sites, their environment, the communities, covering the total area of 401 square kilometres. There are nearly 100 other temples in Angkor Archaeological Park that are inscribed in the World Heritage List. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.